What's up guys, it's your boy Bren coming at you from uh, Team Elite Savage with uh, Deck Profile, another one. It's not Max Knights this time, I know that's all I've done so far. It's a uh, Sky Striker, it's, uh, it's a deck I got top three with uh, at Locals, you know, support your local businesses, wear a mask, you know, whatever. I'm uh, surprised it's not a Mystic Mind deck, sir. Uh, yes, I'm not playing Mystic Mind anymore. I, uh, Deck's too powerful, I want to give these guys a chance. Especially, you know, Dino, Inferno, uh, Dragon Link, whatever the scrubs are playing these days. Uh, anyway, let's go. Guys, I have three, Ray is Bay. I don't tell that to my girlfriend. <laughs> Wink. Anyway, this is the best card in the deck. You want to see it. If you don't see it, I mean, you're just stalling for time till you see it. This uh, lets you attack for directly. It lets you Foolish Barrier, it lets you Suzuku, it lets you Kagari. Do it again if your monster gets destroyed. Special summoner, best card in the deck. I mean, you can't play Sky Striker without it. And then the Rose, I'm considering bumping it up to two. I have, I played some matches where I needed a Sky Striker card. I don't see the Ray. I play Pot, so sometimes it does get banished. But uh, I might pick it up at, I might pick up another one. There are 15s though, currently. I don't know if that's worth the investment, but it's still a good card. Uh, it has effects. <laughs> One Panker Tops, uh, obvious reasons. It's a good card. There's a reason it's at one. You special, you pop. Bada bing, bada boom. So you would say yours is a go, go second deck? It's a very go second deck. Sky Striker doesn't have engage anymore, so it does. It loses a lot of the ability to go first. Uh, so you don't get the cards you need. If you had engage at least at one, engage, Widow Anchor, whatever you're playing, honestly. Uh, then I'm playing three uh, Ash Blossoms, one with Feet Picks. I uh, I traded for these for two of these. He didn't have a third, so this is what I'm playing currently. After that, we got three effect bailers. Uh, I got one platinum because I <laughs> couldn't find my other ultra and a buddy of mine let me borrow it. Uh, okay. And then we have three gammas, best hand trap in the current format. I have uh, honestly, I mean, against like a lot of decks, it just stops them if you know what choke points. I mean, if they're gonna combo off, they're gonna combo off. It's still a good card. And then the one driver. For the gamma package, obviously, always. and then for the sky striker cards, I played three widow anchor, two afterburners, uh, two uh, shark cannons. It's good for dinos. One uh, hornet drones. Uh, there's a reason it's at one. You know, it's a free uh, ray, kagari, Shizuku, whatever you need at the time. Uh, the one multi roll. I call this card engage, just because it gets you all the cards back. If you see it in the starting hand, it's great. If you don't, you can still search it out. I played three Pot of Desires. At first, I was very adamant about playing only two Pots. Uh, most of the decks I play that I want to search stuff. The reason is you want to see Pots. Uh, whether you're going first or second, uh, no matter what, you want to draw those two cards because advantage in this current format is what's needed. Uh, one upstart, just for draw power. Uh, pot of Avarice, uh, a lot of people don't like this card. I am not a huge fan of it. I recently found out that if you ash this card, you don't add the monsters. I thought adding the monsters was cause, but you know, that just goes to show I don't know everything still, even though I've been playing for a while. Might take it out. One Harpy's Feather Duster. No one sees it coming anymore. I mean, Nadir, who's even playing, uh, what's that deck called that everyone forgot about? Uh, invoked. Uh... Stars. Yeah, Trickstar. Yeah, Trickstar. No, uh. Dogmatic. Dogmatica, yeah. If you, I've harpy feather dusted people so hard they just leave. They're like, all right, it's cool. Uh, one uh, Rota searches out your ray. Two of the field spell. Uh, I like area zero. Uh, you know, if uh, you're playing someone like dinos and they go Jurassic World, they summon a dino, they give you a token, they're like, haha, you can't do shit. Okay, area zero, target the token. And if you see a, a Stride Striker card, you're, you're chilling, but if you don't, well, damn, they got the game. Uh, here we played three Mystic Minds. This is one of the win conditions. I thought you yeah. weren't playing Mystic Mind, bro. Uh, I'm not. Uh, technically, this is Sky Striker, but uh, you know, you always gotta play the spice. You gotta piss people off. You gotta hold them out. Uh, I'm not a big fan of this card. <laughs> I, I mean, I love it when I play it, but the thing is, I mean, uh, people give me those death stares. They're like, oh, you're playing Mystic Mind? I'm like, yep, do you have an out? They're like, maybe. I'm not like, sure. Terraforming and set rotation. This is for searching out your field spells. Uh, this blocks out dinos pretty well. Uh, you know, you give them the Sky Striker card, you keep a Mystic Mind set, and then you just can't Jurassic World, you set your cards. I mean, they can still Miscellanosaurus, and that's fine, but uh, what you really want to be able to do is target their stuff, so that's why you keep it. Terraforming to search out the stuff. And then the last uh, hand trap we have is Infinite Impermanence. It's honestly the best hand trap of this current format. It's not a monster, 
There's hardly any cards that can negate it. No one's playing Prohibition like that. Uh, wink. Uh, so yeah, definitely one of the best hand traps in the game currently. How many cards are you? 42. You 42? I'm playing 42, yes. Uh, technically 41 because of uh, Upstart. So for the extra deck, I'm playing three Hayate, one ulti, one prismatic, one super. Uh, a good friend of mine once said that you play high rarities to see them. I just play high rarities to stun. All right, and then we go Kagari, uh, Kagari, Kagari. We play the ulti, we play the prismatic, we play the alternate art. I like the alternate art. I really wish we were getting in the gold series, but it hasn't been, I know things been confirmed. Sad, sad. Anyway, next one. We have Shizuku, ulti, prismatic, super. Uh, this is one of the best cards in the deck. You end your turn, you add whatever you want. Uh, at literally any Sky Striker card besides actual Ray. Great card. And the one Kana, everyone just plays it at one. This is if you have uh, Ray on field, you use her effect, summon out Kana, stop one of their monsters from attacking for like two turns, technically. One Zeke, this is to get rid of uh, any monsters lingering in the main monster zone and then banish a card, monster on, face up on your opponent's side of the field. One Omega, this one's funny. Uh, you go Gamma on your own turn, let's say you go Pot of Avarice, they go Ash, okay, Gamma. Uh, then you just Synchro Summon it, rip one of their cards out of their hands. It's it's funny when it pops up. I was playing uh, Hita, but eh, it's not that great. Honestly, this is a better card and, you know, secret. Uh, so next we have uh, Access Code Package, uh, which is pretty much just Crystron, Selene, uh, Access Code. I, didn't have that much monies to get it in uh, English. I got it German. Shout out to that boy Jacob for a good deal. Uh, anyway, you go Christron, summon out your effect Baylor. You go into Selene. You probably will have three spells because it, it considers both uh, both players' fields and graveyards. And then you just three counters, special summon the effect Baylor, go into access code uh, GG. All right, guys. Oh, this has been my Sky Striker going second deck profile. Like I said, I got third place. I've been playing it. I've been having a lot of fun with it. It does well against Rogue. Uh, against the current format, you just have to have a good hand. It's just uh, against Inferno Bulls, I mean, they're gonna rip some stuff out. If you draw into stuff, you might win. It's just been a fun deck. Uh, I, everyone's playing uh, meta. I'm not trying to be one of these meta sheep. And, uh, but yeah, definitely, definitely a fun deck. What's up guys, uh, it's your boy Brand coming at you from uh, Team Elite Savage, uh, you know, name pending. Uh, <laughs> coming at you with it.